Hello everybody, Iceland League Farmer here, and welcome back to Aussie Farm. Um, last time we actually um, did take an um, seeded field 5 and fertilized that with, if I remember, PK, or was it N, nutrients N. I don't remember. Um, anyway, <laughs> yeah. Anyway, um, I have uh, seeded field one, two, and six, so they are already finished. So they are growing, and um, I was um, thinking of um, fertilizing the grass field so we can um, get uh, the 100% of it and um, that is just the job that we need to do because um, uh, if we don't do that we will not get 100% out of the fields and uh, like the grass field here I want to do more um, silage and we can uh, if we get this to uh, produce 100% then it's just good for us and we can cut it over and over again of course can we don't see anything is it not showing yeah it's showing it's blue yeah, you can see a little bit of the blue there. Um, I was thinking, as you can see on the side there, the uh, neutrons N and neutrons PK are 3 and 2. If I take now uh, NPK, we will get 3 neutrons N and 1 neutrons PK. So that will... Um, give us uh, neutrons N6 and neutrons PK3 uh, and then I was thinking going over one more time with uh, after the if we put the time first and um, then we will put neutrons PK once more time and that will give us plus three and then we will have uh, neutrons PK at uh, six I th think yeah and that is okay actually because then we are in uh, in the boundaries of um, the soil mod and that will s give us 100% uh, out of uh, the grass field and then we can cut it and see uh, put it in the silage I think it will be interesting to see um, if we are going to see any different we baled actually 16 bales if I remember right of hay out of this field but uh, I was thinking we could rent um, rent uh, forage wagon and uh, pick it up with a forage wagon and um, that will uh, put and put it right away in, into the silo at the farm or the BGA. Could put it in the BGA silo because, as you can see, uh, our money have went down because of um, I filled the cedar with seeds. And if I remember right, I was on cotton cotton when I did that. And the cotton seeds seems to be really expensive. So I didn't think about that uh, when I was changing uh, and filling it up. Um, and it ended up that it costed me over 40,000 to fill it up. So uh, the, the cedar takes about 22,000 liters. <laughs> and uh, it costed me over uh, 40,000 to fill it. So, yeah, 
there was our money. Now uh, they, it is negative. So now we just um, speed up the time here a little bit. There. Um, I don't remember. We actually should go down uh, to field uh, five, actually, and check out what we need next time. I actually. Or if we just was going to put uh, beat prevention, so herbicide. I actually forgot to t check. Um, I think cotton just stop the tractor here. Could just put whatever, I don't know. Or we just um, spray water on it, I don't know. I'm not sure if we need any beat prevention uh, on the cotton anyway. But um, I don't want to put uh, weed prevention um, that um, will kill the plant. That should be. That is not good because then we have done all the work and um, <laughs> for nothing. That is not what we want to do. So let's see here if we drive out on the field here. We are neutrons and are at three. The neutrons PK. We should um, we should actually put neutrons N on this field. If we just take uh, take uh, neutrons n, then we will five, and that will keep us still in um, the boundaries. Early man on sale. Yeah, we don't have any m money to buy any early man anyway. <laughs> yeah, I know this is. Um, really much about the soil mod anyway all the time now but it is quite um, a job to to uh, control all everything with the soil mod at least when you have uh, big fields and many fields I have uh, these four fields now and that is quite a lot of job to manage um, I think if we are having more fields, it's going to be uh, much, much more work for us. But I, I really lo like this map uh, in many ways. It's really open, the fields are, are nice, these ditches are a little bit special. It would be nice if that could help uh, bordering uh, the, the fields because some of them, like the one that we have our uh, number five, is really dry. It's only 14%. We need to get that up. And that's why we should use um, the fertilized sprayer, not, uh, yeah, the, not this one, the other one. And spray uh, a liquid manu uh, liquid uh, fertilizer instead. But, um, yeah. What was I? I totally forgot. Was it? And we are driving like madmen here. Driving all over. Yeah. No, PK was it? I think it was PK. I'm talking too much. I forget everything that I'm saying. 
Yeah, PK. So let's just go with the fertilizer over there to the sprayer and lower the tank. Can can we just put it here? Fill it here? Or is this only liquid? There. And we need to let the time pass. How is the food? The cows. We need, we need to feed them. I'm not sure if this is going to be enough for the night. But we can turn it off and jump out and put the time a little bit faster here. So we can spray the last um, PK on the grass field over there. there and the money status is getting better every day <laughs> and it's so soon I need to feed them it's not that much left was it five five thousand seven hundred liters Wait, wait for the soil mod again. I've been thinking um, maybe should borrow more money again. I don't know. So we can buy yourself um, some some pigs and uh, beef or cattle, so we can uh, start start them uh, to produce and grow there the, is the soil mod finished so let's just speed up the time so we can get in the morning there jump in this our nice john deere really nice mod from uh, forbidden mods really good one Really well done, I think. And I just love the sound in it. It's just uh, 